Hello guys, Sigma here and today I'm going to do a tier list on the Heat members. They really wanted this video so I thought I'd bring it out. It's only half true so they shouldn't get really butthurt about this. It's just light hearted banter, it's a bit of fun. So if your clan is interested in me doing a tier list on your clan or yourself, just put your clan down below and I uh, will do a video on it. It'd be a quite fun one. So here we go, let's get into it. Some say... He's all brawn and no brains. He says he works in a gas station. But we all know what he's really pumping. And it's not gas. It's ass. He thinks he's a ladies man. But we all have seen his bushy tash. It's more like a bull tickler. We would even make Freddie Mercury look straight and clean shaven. In game, you may know him as the silent slayer. But he puts the cock into cockpit. Let the tash see some gash. It's Abraham. So guys, um, Abraham's here. And I think he's a pretty good player overall. And, you know, he lets the team down sometimes, don't you, Abe's mate? So uh, he's, he's more of a solo man, you know. He likes dropping on weak teams, so it makes him look good. So... I'm going to stick him in A. A for Abraham. There you go, mate. Hope you're happy with that. On to the next one. Boop. This guy, he lives down under. His breath smells so bad, you can even smell it through Discord. His favourite sayings are, Good day, mate. There's nothing about you. He thinks he's funny, but what he doesn't know, we're laughing at him. He sends dick pics on the daily. They say it's the size of a dust cap. He talks like he's ascended from the heavens and belongs in S tier. I will be the judge of that. He puts the skip into Skippy. Let the alien see the Australian. It's Aussie. So guys. I'm going to rate Ozzy now. Oh, look at him. He looks like Steve Irwin and that lion man's love child. He's cute, isn't he? So, Ozzy's a bit of a tricky one. He's a bit of a one-trick pony. So, since these EMs come out, he's gone from like a D to B slash A. So, because I like him, I'm going to put him to A, next to Abe's. So, there you go, Ozzy. Hope you're ready. Not quite S tier yet, mate. You were a D to A, so there you have it. The next guy on the list, he goes by many names, but on the weekend, it's Sally. His favourite sounds are, hoik my skirt up, and you in my way. Nowadays, he smokes more bongs than Mex. He's a has-been. He's rustier than Madeline McCann's bicycle. He's cracked more screens than the lawnmower man. He puts the meat into meat spin. Let the big see the head. It's Big Head. And there he is. So, he used to be up here in the S tiers before he quit, right? And he, But he's come back now, right? So he's gone all the way from S down to, I'd say, a D because he sucks, right? But now... I'm going to stick him in C, right? C for crap, because he's still crap, right? And he knows he is, right? It's not B for big head, it's C. You belong in the garbage, son, all right? Get your head out your bootay, right? And I'm fed up with your, hoo -hoo, I'm this, I'm that. You're nothing, son, you're nothing. C it is. Next up, we call him the one-thumbed Thumbelina. He says he was attacked by a pack of ferocious dogs. But we all know the truth. He got caught stealing Werther's originals from Granny's handbag. He goes by a dynamic name, but he's nothing but a puppy. But he puts the light into twilight. Let the dog see the kennel. It's Cerberus! Cerberus, right buddy? You know, he's a good friend of mine. He looks actually a spitting image of my granddad. I call him Gramps and he thinks it's funny, but I'm not even joking. 
So Cerberus, right? Good player, but he's got a thumb missing. So he's he's gone down. So he's he's probably better or just as good as Big Head. Big Head, you're crap, mate. You know, you're annoying me even being on here. What are you doing? That Cerberus, I I think you're better, actually better than Big Head with one thumb. But there you go, mate. Put you and C for now. You know, what can I do? Big Ed might as well quit the game. The next pilot, he's a lone wolf. Not much is known about this shadow player. But, don't get me wrong, he's a Spartan, a born killer. They say he can part oceans with one single crack of his nuts. They say when he's bored, he won V5s for warm-ups. He puts the Aeons into Final Fantasy. He puts the May into him. It's chaos! Yep, he's a good player, but he doesn't play with us much. So he's still bigger than, better than Big Head, because, I don't know, Big Head's still annoying me, he's on here. Um, yeah, so I put him in B for now. Um, there you go. This is what it looks like at the moment. This is the tier list. On to the next one. This next pilot lassoes more women than I've had hot dinners. He says, yeehaw, and bucks more times than buckaroo. He likes to 1v1 as another one-trick EM pony. He has no life. Boring to talk to. We all feel sorry for him. If I ever visit Louisiana, I'll buy him a friend. He puts the whips into whippies. Let the cow see the grass. It's cowboy. And there he is, cowboy. He's a really good player since the AMs come out. You know, he used to be sub-average. <laughs> now he's an A. Um, that's what the uh, scoreboard's looking at so far. So yeah, it's looking quite decent. I say that's correct. Big Ed's still on there. Still annoy me. Let's move on. The next pilot. We all know him. As the Karen of Macarena, he likes to talk the talk, but can he walk the walk? He calls himself the Canadian Goose, but we all like to call him Tweety Pie. Because he's cute. On forums, he likes to rumble like Apple Crumble. He puts the nuts in guts. Let the Karen see the manager. It's these nuts. So. Yeah, these nuts is next, and here he is with his Karen haircut. Bless him. Yeah, he's a really good player, you know. Yeah, but at the same time, he's not. He's just on Big Ed's level. They both annoy the shit out of me. So I'm going to put him above Big Ed because I like him a lot better than Big Ed. Did you know Big Ed should be a D or less? But you know, these nuts, you're going B for get better. You know, with chaos. You know, you both belong in that little section of B. Yeah, behave, mate. Right, next one. The next pilot. He likes to pretend he's a ladies' man. He likes to pretend he goes salsa dancing five times a week. But we all know the truth. You're a pole dancer, paying off your Macarena spending addiction. Times are tough. He thinks he can keep with the English banter, but... I pretend to understand him. He makes absolutely zero sense. A whisper told me he hits up ominouses regularly for bun fun. He puts the pole into pole dance. Let the smile see the face. It's Fonzie. Yeah, Fonzie used to be an S tier, but he's quit now. So he's not quit. He's not playing. He's playing T3 like a little wimp. So... D he goes, he's even lower than Big Head, and that's saying something. Right, Fonzie, you're all there, mate. The next pilot. He was born at the age of zero and has survived as a successful living organism on his planet until present day. His biology consists of three components. One, a structural mass. Two, a nervous system which detects external forces exerting pressure upon his mass. And three, 
a muscular frame to carry his team. They know him as the best of the best. He puts the king into mini king. He says, let the story see the boy. It's Grudge Nort. He's my homie. Yes, Grudge Nort, my number one English chap. Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying, blood. Yeah, he's S tier. Of course he's S tier. He's the only S tier. Well, there may be some few more, maybe. We'll see. Yeah, Grudge Nort, you're S tier, man. Stay true, my brother. Go and check his channel out, Mecarina Central. This next pilot, they say he's the biggest hothead around. The rumour has it he knows where the devs live and sends them death threats and pictures of their families through their post boxes. Rumour has it his entire email outbox consists of Ukraine hate mail. The guy wrote the dictionary of naughty words. He puts the kill into Killjoy. Let the Illumin see the party. That's right, it's Kaluminati. Kaluminati. Uh, a new member to the group, but he's very, very good. So he goes straight to A. Yeah, definitely A. He don't let the team down like the rest of them. Anyway, cool. This next pilot, he flies like a butterfly, stings like a bee. A real team player. However, this hoe ain't loyal. He left MTM for the higher power. A glory supporter. He talks a lot about his pilot days, but the only flying he does is flying low. He puts the plane into aeroplane. Let the old see the man. It's Lavrus. Yeah. Oh, my voice is getting sore. Uh, very good team supporter. Very good team player. And he helps us out tremendously. You know, if we've got any feats to do, he's always there for us. So for that, he goes straight into A tier. I love you, man. He's top quality bloke. And yeah, sound. On to the next one then. This next pilot thinks he has a roar. It's more of a squeak. He posts more losses than wins. No one knows his origins. Some whispers say he's French. In that case, ooh la la. No wonder he gets squashed like a frog. He puts the Leo into lion. Let this frog see the spawn. It's Lion X. Yeah, so Lion X is quite of a new guy. I don't really know him that well. When I've played with him, he's let me down a few times. So, yeah, he's just as bad as Big Ed. So, in you go, mate. See you go. This pilot has two accounts, both stronger than mine. Rumour has it she owns shares in Mecarina. She giggles like a nervous schoolgirl when she's about to have her first kiss. People say she's just happy-go-lucky. I say happy-go-ducky because she's quackers. She puts the hour in golden shower. Let the mech see the hangers. It's Nuna, a.k.a. Vlad here. Yeah, there she is. A very good team player. Uh, owner of SIG and she's also in our clan as well, So, which is nice. Um, so, yeah, A tier, definitely. Nothing more, nothing less. This next pilot, he is the musical mouse. He likes pineapple on his pizza. He's the super nerd of heat. Also, the smooth talker. When you're feeling down, this pilot can talk you into a state of mindfulness. When you're feeling angry, his soft angelic voice soothes you from every inch of your body. But don't get on his wrong side. He's known to be a potty mouth and hates to lose. He puts the cal into musical. He puts the pineapple on the pizza. So let's the pineapple see the pizza. It's cal. Yeah, very good player. He hasn't been on much, so I'm going to derank him to a B. So, yeah, there he is. That's all you, cal. This next guy was a hero amongst men. A whisper 
in the wind. Scored the highest damage in events, won every major tournament. Stole my name, but I let him have it. Because he's still a virgin, and I felt sorry for him. The ultimate Ebenezer mouth breather. He puts the love into McLovin. Let the nerd see a bird. It's a mega! Yeah. It's me, yeah, it's me. Mega. He's a very good player. He used to be an S tier back in the day, so he's quit and he doesn't really play. His hanger's not up to where it used to be. So I'd say he's probably mid tier with, um, yeah, the mid tier people. Um, D's nuts, uh, you know, just mid tier. He sucks with Big Ed. Um, no, I'm only joking. Mid tier is actually really good, especially in heat anyway. Um, okay, I'll go to the next one. This next pilot is a mystery. Is it a man or is it a machine? But we all know he cries like a little schoolgirl on prom night when you use mortars against bots. He's the definition of all the gear and no idea. And legend has it, he's an English northerner. So he must not wash. He smells like chips and curry. His foreskin is that cheesy. You can use it as rocket fuel. He puts the Stilton in Paris Hilton. Let the Smorter see the mechs. It's optimal. Yeah, he's an average player. BE Ghost. Yeah, uh, he gets all the new stuff and that, so he knows what it's all about. But yeah, B. There we go. Next one. This next pilot, he invites rust buckets to the teams and loses. He plays tournament at work. In the bath, in bed, and whilst he's making love, his tournament spree never ends. He cuts trees for a living, but what he needs to do is cut his ties with the rubbish players he plays with. He puts the poo into Winnie the Pooh. Let the log see the toilet. It's Sab 50 Cow. Yep. You go to D, my friend. D, you go. I know you and Fonzie play together a lot. And, you know, you like best bezzy wingers and stuff like that. So I let you two do what you do and you can stay in D tier. You guys suck. <laughs> let me tell you a story about this next pilot. When you say it's blown a gale, the guy's nearby. When you hear the trees flustering, car's alarm beeping, turf unpeeling, this guy is nearby. He likes to run funky hangers, but we all know him as Defeat Guy. He also likes to refer himself in third person. That is what Daddy likes. If you have not met this guy, you haven't met your match. He puts the wind into pass wind. Let the weak... See the geek? It's Stormy! So, yeah, so Stormy next. Very good player. Up he goes to S tier. Who obviously beats everyone on this list. Nearly as good as Grudge. I'd say probably better actually. There you go. Stormy. Boop. On you go. This next pilot. He is a legend born to lead. The Ultra OG. He doesn't need to play much. Nor any introduction. I'm tearing up just talking about him. It's like electric running up my spine. He puts the gods in gods. Let the gold see the finger. It's stick. There you go. Straight to S tier. The OG of the OG. The guy that created heat. There he is. This next pilot, they call him the heartbreaker, the love maker, the bum shaker. Whispers have it. He likes sniffing dirty underwear for that duck butter. He's burnt more bread than the atomic blast in the Chernobyl accident. They call him the Whisperer, Worm Tongue. He puts the barely legal into Smeagol. Let the Lord see the ring. It's Sucker Smeagol. Sucker Punch. There he is. Um... Very good play. He can go right next to Nuna, just like that. Two little team buddies there. He's a really good player. I um yeah, not much else to say really. 
Last but not least, this pilot needs no introduction. He's a whisper to the gods. They call him Zeus of Heat. They call him the best of the best of the best. Best. I can't believe he's here. He's the one and only. You know what I'm gonna say. You can see him at the bottom. And yeah, you know, D tier. Fucking, I I am terrible at the game. I'm not gonna lie to you. So yeah, that's me. And then that's my list. So I hope you're happy with that list. And um, yeah. So if you want me to do a video on your clan, just drop me a message and I'll happily do one. It's still light-hearted banter, so it's not like serious. It's sort of just, I can pick you anywhere and just do the introduction. It's quite fun. Um, so if you like the video, please give a like, comment and subscribe. Hello? Oh, right, Big Ed. What do you mean you're upset because you're an S uh, C tier? Yeah, I know you're upset, but I'm just, I'm leaving as it is. Yeah, I know. I understand. Really? You'd do that for me? All right, I'll put you an S now. And you promise you'll hoik your skirt up for me and call yourself Sally on the weekend. Uh, uh, yeah, awesome. You're an S. Yeah. Right. Yeah, happy. All right. Bye.